Whenever you're ready. <laughs> ready? <laughs> Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. So if you have been watching me for a while, you'll know that this is my sister Sam. Hi. So I have my birthday dinner tonight. I turned 24 on Tuesday, which is real weird. So we decided to film a video of us getting ready together. So if you want to see how we did it, just keep on watching. So what do you <laughs> 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 You have some grief on YouTube. I'm using Benefit Professional for my primer. I've started using two primers on my face at a time. So I use a pore feeling primer in the center of my face and then I'll use a glowy primer around the perimeter. I hope you didn't buy this. This is the smallest thing <laughs> no, I've ever seen. <laughs> I'm going to use the Mecca Cosmetica Lip From Within. Um, this is a glowy primer and I'm going to use that on the perimeter. Just to give myself a little bit of a glow. So Sam, what have you been up to since the last time we saw you? You know what I realized yesterday? What? So the last time I was in your video, I was in high school. Oh really? Uh-huh. And now oh, I've graduated gosh. university. That's so Isn't that weird. so weird? That's I was thinking about that yesterday. You got boogers. <laughs> oh, I can see it. Gross. Do you want me to get in? No. <laughs> Oh, look. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, well, I'm gonna just put my foundation on straight away. I'm gonna use a little bit of Flexitarian by Colourpop and I'm just chugging a whole bunch of that on my cheekbone because once I put my foundation on, it'll be toned down a little bit. May I have a tissue in the second drawer? It's the third drawer. Well, second drawer from the bottom. Did you say second drawer from the bottom? <laughs> Um, I think I'm gonna do my eyes first. Really? Yeah. What because order do you go? Because I normally do face first. Really? Mm-hmm. But... I do something weird. What do you do? <laughs> I do my forehead with foundation. <laughs> then I put eyebrows on. Then I do my under eyes and the top of my nose. Then I do my eyes and then I do my cheeks. Oh my god, that is so <laughs> Isn't Why? that fucking funny? Because that's just the order that makes sense to me. No. <laughs> I'm glad I, now that I know it's weird, I'm glad I disclaimed it before, I, <laughs> before, you before doing everyone's it. like, what the fuck is she doing? <laughs> See, my forehead's done. Time for eyebrows. <laughs> it was so weird. Do you want to talk about your wedding? Yeah, that's exciting. She's getting married. I am. Mm -hmm. So it is July at the moment and I'm getting married in May next year. So it's exciting. very exciting. I actually had an appointment with a florist today. Mm -hmm. Flowers are expensive. It's a really mm -hmm. good time. But yeah, it's really exciting. I picked up my wedding. <laughs> I picked up my wedding dress last week. Oh, by the way, if the lighting turns really bad or if it's really loud, we're in the middle of a storm at the moment. It's been a bit crazy, so that would be why. Is that a blonde part in my hair? What is this? <laughs> That. I got concealer in my eyebrows. I'm sorry, but what? It looks cute. I haven't been blonde since I was like 13 years old. Jordy, oh, I did bleach it, yeah. When did you bleach it? The last time I was dyeing Dimitri's hair, when I was dyeing it red, I think, I put a bleach strip at the back of my hair down there. Why? <laughs> because I wanted to match. <laughs> But I didn't have commitment issues, so oh I just gosh. did one strand of hair. I look like a raccoon. Yeah. A raccoon? Yeah. Well, the opposite. opposite raccoon. I was about to call it a raccoon. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Maisie was a kitten the last time we did a video together. <gasps> she was! And, and she, she liked me! Yeah, she used to actually enjoy the company. Rude. I've actually left my eyebrows like this before. Outline. <laughs> And I didn't fill them in, and oh, I went to the shops. <laughs> that's so embarrassing. I don't know what eyeshadow palette to use. Excuse me. Excuse me. Can I use the Kat Von D Shade and Light palette? No shade, please. Whoa. <laughs> what a name. What are you going to give a little light? <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to be doing green eyeshadow today. I think I started off with a colour that's too dark and I'm regretting it. What if I can't come back from me, Sam? Oh, that looks bad. Truth or dare, Sam? <gasps> you know what? Dare. Go home. <laughs> Sam, would you rather have feet for hands or hands for feet? Hands for feet, hands down. <laughs> because you'd just be like a monkey. 
Yeah, okay. <laughs> That's it. I just don't want feet on me. <laughs> well, <laughs> yeah, you would be like a monkey. You'd always be doing a handstand. What am I not doing a handstand? Oh, sorry, I got my sniffing. <laughs> <laughs> hey Siri, can you ask me a would you rather question? She doesn't want would you rather the aliens that make first contact be robotic or organic? That's a great question. Oh, that's scary. Organic, 100%. You reckon? Well, would you yes, you'd rather them be robots? In War of the Worlds, they all died out because of the um, because of the cold. That's true. So, if they're organic, they might not have immunity to our diseases. And they'll die off. Do you actually, do you reckon that aliens exist. I think it's pretty naive to say they don't. Yeah, for sure. I don't know, narcissistic, I think. Yeah, absolutely. Who says they don't exist? Like, think about how big the universe is. Don't they say that there are, like, more planets or galaxies? <laughs> <laughs> don't they say that there are, like, more galaxies or planets or something in the universe than there are grains of sand on all of the beaches? <laughs> that sounds like a rumour. That sounds like the way you said it. Makes it seem like like a Chinese whisper. <laughs> <laughs> it does sound like that. There are uh, more stars in the universe than grains of sand in all of the beaches. Well, <laughs> more planets. <laughs> well, we don't know how many galaxies are there out there. Twenty four is a weird age, you guys. One. Um, cool. It's a good story, Grandpa. Would you rather never eat hot chips again or never have coffee again? What kind of sick person are you? <laughs> I would obviously give up chippies. Yeah, it's hard life, but... You picked the two things I love the most out of everything. Would you rather lose the ability to read or lose the ability to speak? Ooh, speak. Really? I love reading. Yeah, I don't really like your voice either. Wow. <laughs> no, well, because I can write things down. Oh, but then I couldn't sing. And I love singing. Losing the ability to speak, I think. <laughs> Would you rather never have a pet cat again or never have coffee again? <laughs> I'd never have a pet cat again. What? What about Buckley? He's not mine. You always say he's yours. Don't even try it. Yeah, I've just probably switched to dogs. I would give up coffee for Buckley in particular, but I wouldn't just give up coffee knowing that I could have a cat. What about your little wrinkly cats? Oh yeah. I'm gonna use some Get Your Glitter On Glitter Primer by Essence. I've never used it before, so mm. it's yeah, not I thought you shit. used glitter glue. In two faces. Glitter primer doesn't feel very tacky. I'm gonna use the Urban Decay Moonless Shadow palette, and I'm gonna use this shade Galaxy. Already. More often than not, are harder than hot. Have you seen Aladdin yet? I'm gonna need you to stop that. <laughs> no, have you seen it? No. It's so good. Really? Really? What? Oh, yeah. Sponsored? Yes. This video is in fact sponsored by Aladdin. By Aladdin. <laughs> by Will Smith himself. You know what I really want to try? What? Drew Barrymore, she has a um, a makeup range out at the moment. Oh, she really? The chemist Warehouse. Mm. It's called Flower or Flower Cosmetics or something like that. And I really want to try it. That was cool. What kind of stuff? Like everything? Yeah, all sorts of stuff. And apparently it's pretty inexpensive. I think I'm going to put a little bit of light here, just in the center. Make a little more glowy. Would you rather be covered in fur or covered in scales? Ooh, fur. Really? What if they were like really pretty like... Unicorn Ooh, skin scales. Yeah, scales. Scales. Your nasty. Mermaid scales. <laughs> Would you rather be in jail for a year or lose a year of your life? Well, when I come out of jail, do I have the stigma of being in jail? No, you just have to endure being in jail for a year. I'd probably get a super buff in jail. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> well, because all you can do is work out. <laughs> Oh my god, that's well, not true at all. You could sleep. I could catch up on my reading. Probably lose a year of my life, I reckon. Really? Well, because I like my life because I'm able to be with my friends and see my family and stuff. That you'd rather be dead for a year? I'd rather be dead for a year. 
Get off me. Um, I can't believe that. I can't believe you would rather die. I don't, you didn't say I'd have to be dead. Lose a year of your life, meaning you would die a year earlier. Oh, so what like, do you think I meant? No, I thought you meant that like right now. I'd be 25 instead of 24. What? <laughs> I got confused. Yeah, so now that you know the question, what's your answer? Prison. Get back at one in your collection. You thief. Yeah, mum's so hesitant to let me borrow any of her stuff because I never give it back. Using Nas Shilo in the car Siberia. Would you rather always be 10 minutes late or always 20 minutes early? That is the dumbest one ever. 20 minutes early, obviously. No. You'd be late. What? <laughs> I thought we would be on the same page for that. Why would you want to be late everywhere? That means you're always late to every movie. I love how you straight away think about the cinema. Well, I love the cinema. <laughs> 10 minutes late, you'd miss all of the shit previews. I like the previews. You like the ads? No, not the ads. Would you rather know the history of every object you've ever touched or be able to talk to animals? Talk to animals, obviously. Right? <laughs> Who would pick history? No, that'd be gross. You'd sit on a seat and know every ass that's touched <laughs> it. Would you rather be able to talk to land animals, animals that fly, or animals that live under the water? I can't even hold my breath for that one under the water. How would I? Talk I don't to think that <laughs> comes into it. Assume that you could that they come out of the water to talk to you. When was the last time an animal came out of the water to talk to you? Land animal. You would pick land animal. Yeah. I think I would want to talk to the birds. Why? Magpies are so sweet and. I love feeding them and then after a while they get to know you and they will like see your, see you from far away and know that it's you and know that you'll feed them and they like swoop down and come come to see you. I feel like we could have a good chat and they could also be spies for you. What about Tom and Buckley? I don't think I want to hear what he has to say. <laughs> I like the one-sided relationship we have. Oh my gosh. Um, Buckley's our mum's cat. My cat. He's mine. He just said he wasn't yours. He's not mine. Would you rather give up all drinks except for water or give up eating anything that was cooked in the oven? All drinks except for water. Oh wait, cooked in the oven. What? <laughs> so the camera died, so I have set my face with some powder and Sam's just been working on her eyes. Yeah, I just kind of like went over everything, made everything darker. I'm going to put on some Laguna bronzer. Would you rather go into the deepest depths of the ocean or into outer space? And you have to be there for like at least half an hour. <laughs> Out of space. Out of space? Is it out of? Out of space. <laughs> I'm out of space. Uh, I would 100% go to space. I would be really scared. Have you ever seen the movie Gravity? It's no, really but I know. It's just scary as. But what about oh, all the animals you'd see in the sea? I reckon there would be so many like giant like Huge mutants, sharks, and whales, and stuff that we don't even know about. There'd be so many yeah. crazy animals. I love like swimming and snorkeling and stuff, but the ocean kind of gives me incredible anxiety. Does this make you nervous? <laughs> ooh! Ooh! You show the camera, huh? Please. Don't bully me. Yeah, you will get bullied. Ew, it won't even focus because it's so <laughs> gross. Ew, oh, I touched it. Sam, you have to clean it. Yeah, I'll clean it. Sam, I only recently started using blush. I've always despised blush. I've hated it with a passion. Same with lip gloss. And now I use both of them. I don't know why I've always hated blush. I just feel like it looks like you're embarrassed. I put blush over my nose as well. I love I think Kylie blush. Jenner. Oh, thank you. I'm using Benefit Cobra for my eyebrows today. Would you rather mm -hmm. have a pet unicorn or a pet dragon? I don't think I know enough about either of those creatures to make that decision. I reckon dragon for sure. What does a unicorn even do? They run around looking all cute. Mm, that's not enough for me, I don't think. What about a pegasus? What's that? It's a horse that has wings. Probably that. No, I reckon dragon. Why? Because I love dragons. Remember I used to be obsessed with dragons? Yeah, you had that book called Dragonology. I still have that book. Would you rather go to the ballet or the opera? Hmm, the ballet. I actually really want to go to the opera. Really? Mm-hmm. I love the ballet. It's oh, I want to do that as well. That I would love to go to the opera. Male, female, or both? Both, but I think female opera singers really inspire me. So do you want to like be an opera singer? 
No, I don't want to be an opera singer, but I find it incredible. When you first started, did you have major trouble looking in the viewfinder? Because I never look at the lens. Yeah. Ever. I still find that really hard. I'm also, always just like talking. Also because my camera it does have trouble focusing sometimes. So sometimes I'm looking always at the viewfinder to make sure that it's actually focusing. Yeah. Um, but sometimes I just feel like I look really conceited because I'm staring straight at yeah. myself in the viewfinder. Ooh. Would you rather have all your clothes fit perfectly or have the most comfortable pillow blanket? Blankets and sheets in existence. Oh, most comfortable pillows, blankets, and sheets. I feel like my clothes don't fit that comfortably now, anyway. So I've been living my life like that for now, and I think that's fine. What about you? I would rather the blankets and stuff. Would you rather be able to breathe underwater or be able to fly? <sighs> I'd rather be able to breathe underwater. Are you scared of the ocean? I'm way more scared of heights. Yeah, but being able to fly would be sick. Would you rather be completely insane and know that you were insane? Or completely insane and believe you are sane. Ooh, we'll probably know that I'm insane. Actually, I really don't know. You might be happier not knowing that you're insane. What would you rather? Um, I don't know. I've met some pretty crazy people that don't know that they're insane. I'd probably rather know. Okay, if you had to be an animal, would you rather be a monkey or a fish? I'd rather be a monkey. Why? Because it's closer to being a human. Would you rather be a bear or a lion? What kind of bear? Any bear you want. I'd rather be a lion. So the camera turned off again. So I've put on a little bit of mascara, some half lashes and a tiny bit of eyeliner. I put some blush on, I did some eyeliner and put my hair up. I think I'm gonna finish my lower lash line now. <laughs> Would you rather be a reverse centaur or a reverse mermaid? Ooh! So, Ew. a fish head with a human body or a horse head with a human body? Horse head. What would you rather? Horse. Would you rather your only mode of transportation be a donkey or a giraffe? Oh, giraffe, absolutely. Really? Wouldn't you pick giraffe? No. A cool would you, animal. Would you like wrap around its neck or would you sit <laughs> on its body? Oh, I don't know. <laughs> You'd sit on its body for sure, so hmm. you wouldn't really like, be that high up. Would you rather rather every shirt you wear to be itchy or only be able to use one ply toilet paper? One ply toilet paper because you can just wrap it around around. No, you can't do that. What? What do you mean? It has to be one ply. No, but that's not part of the game. Yeah, I'm asking you. One ply. Meaning you can only use one ply at a time. Oh, itchy <laughs> shirt for sure. What would you pick? Um, yeah, I just the itchy shirt and then I never wear shirts. So I am using Wow Lip Liner. Look how tiny it's going. I'm using Bow and Arrow by Kat Von D. Would you rather only be able to use a fork, no spoon, or only be able to use a spoon, no fork? I know my answer. I don't use forks anyway. <laughs> spoon, no fork. Really? Because, mm -hmm. like, how would I eat my muesli? How would I, I eat think you could eat cereal? Muesli with a fork. How could I eat ice cream? Doesn't dad eat ice cream with a fork? Ew. <laughs> he does. <laughs> Would you rather have edible spaghetti hair that regrows every night or sweat maple syrup? Ew! <laughs> spaghetti hair. Really? <laughs> <laughs> nah, maple syrup. That's right. nasty. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like it. <laughs> you boob off me. <laughs> So this is how the makeup ended up turning out. So I decided to go with something kind of green toned and smoky. I went for kind of a rose gold look, very warm toned <laughs> and um, coral lips. What would you call this? Like a brown nudie coral? I don't know. That's a good combination. Brown things. nudie coral. <laughs> completely different things. Thank you guys so much for watching and give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and we'll speak to you again soon. Bye! Bye! <laughs>